I, I got another it. good one for you. Yeah, this that? one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. <gasps> oh, shoot! This other time... Officer? Blast the man. Don't make me do this! Daddy? Huh? Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Bang. Get on there. Hammer time. Hammer time. As babysitters go, I'd say your parents owe you a tip. <laughs> What's going on, Scoots? Welcome back to another video where today your boy Scoots Dallas is here back with another video. And we're back with part two of episode one of The Walking Dead, the video game. So, as you guys saw from the intro, um, all the stuff that happened last time, um, we are just now continuing with Sean and Chet to his family farm. I don't know what the freak that was. Hopefully, no one's dead. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. All right. See you, shit. Okay. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, reckon down the way things as mayor has gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Um. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. Oh! Yes, he is. So oh, it's just you and your why? daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He's the babysitter. Honey, do you know this man? Come on, Clem. Yes. Yay! Okay, then. So happy. Well, so happy. Looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Um, could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Huh? Right. How'd this happen? If his name's Herschel, uh, uh... Jumping a fit. Running from something? Just like everybody else. What type of danger has the girl seen? Who knows? She had a few lonely days with nothing but the dead keeping her company. I still well, just can't imagine it. Yeah, I think I was going to talk about. Like oh, if his name's Herschel, they should have called him Hershey, like... We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and okay. your daughter are welcome to rest there, and we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious <laughs> hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. 
Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this yeah. place. Yeah, because like that doesn't happen. We don't want here, any Sean. zombies getting in here. It's a I'm family serious. of three, I think Come you said, or something out in the barn. Like, bro, there, we, we all don't want to be dead. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. By the way, if anyone knows who this is, can help out in the morning. Then we gotta do it, really. I you know. already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. Sweet. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do uh -oh. then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. What? We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, oh. that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Right. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. It smells like... I know what it smells like. Duty. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Jeez. Oh, I love you, baby. <laughs> Great. Nightmare much. Jeez. Hey, get up. Who is you? What? Itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Hmm. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? <laughs> That's funny. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Um, sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build yeah, a he's fence. Right. Yeah, well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will have to kill. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Alright. Thank you. Alright, we'll find the plan. There's ducks, people. Alright. You having a nice time with Katya Clementine? Yeah. Hey there, girls. So, uh, what do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel oh. here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that um, you do, Lee? I used okay. to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, uh, how's that? It's easy. Well, yeah. I assume so. It's easy as grade. So, you're good? Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. 
It's peaceful <laughs> here, huh? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some. Just, just. Uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. I want yeah. to go home tomorrow, but even then, I can't take away the things we, the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? This could all be providence, you know? Not what we saw. You just never realize when something is happening to you, what you're being given. Maybe this will all work out. Your optimism is refreshing. New. These past couple days, at least. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. All right. Well, that was fun. Um, any over here? It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Mm. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance yeah. things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and dolphin. paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Who catches How's dolphins? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the in about two seconds and just lucky I was there we saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's but we're a tough family Lee ain't nothing gonna phase us see you. all right cool up oh, now I'm gonna go talk talk to duck and the other kid I forgot his name John John Green how you doing duck good up, duck. I'm gonna drive the tractor Lift with your back, Sean. You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. <laughs> I'm good. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bytes to length, that sure speed things up. Sure. I'm helpful. Why not? I gotta catch some bugs or something. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Jeez. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't wow. see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't Four fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh, I have a bastard. Poor girl's brains in. Whoa. I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Uh, my brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. Hopefully not. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. No crab. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I'd follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? Uh, 
I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Yeah, she really did. Hmm. She did? I'll give you a piece of advice. Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh crap! Go! I'll get my gun! What the freak is going on? Oh crap! Oh, stupid freaking dog. Oh my god. Oh snap! I have to choose. Oh, he's. Help me! Oh wait, what? Oh. I'll get, I'll get, I'll get, I'll get. Oh. oh crap, are you kidding? Oh my. I'm okay, bro. Don't worry. We'll stitch you up. It, it almost... It almost got me, man. It, they tried to save me. Ah, no, no, Duh, shut up! I know, son. I, uh, oh, my... Duh, shut up! wasn't strong enough. I'm sorry. If your girl is ever trapped, you better hope you get stronger, or your friends aren't cowards. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. Got that ride to make it if you want it. Oh wow. Well. Thank you. I mean I guess I'll keep going for a little bit more. I I, I just didn't seem like that long. Well I hope they don't have more choices like that in the future. We'll have to freaking choose between like two well, people to save. This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. 
Cripes. Cripes, dude. By the way, that like Look. Sean's dad, Sean's dad or whatever, hey should have come out faster with that gun. The trucks run out of gas. No. Oh, <laughs> holy crap! Run, run, run now! <laughs> oh crap! Oh, that's dead. <laughs> Who is you? Who are y'all? I mean, like, thank you, but, like, still, who are y'all? We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Or good people. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Whoa, chill Quack. out, lady. We're just people trying to avoid those things, just like you. Don't come in here and swear at me. I'll say whatever well, I, I think want I just did. These people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? Uh, no, I I didn't see anything. What is it? I I have to <laughs> pee. Oh, uh, thank you. Again in a second. Then just go. <laughs> They've got. Oh wait, I didn't mean like that. Ew. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God oh. damn it, Lily! You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy. <laughs> Son of a. <laughs> One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We Dude, have to just end this now. Big nose weirdo. Over my dead body. What freaking Mario looking hole. head. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't <laughs> people get it? We've already seen this happen. Dude, we let just shut up. Stand, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta yeah, throw him out. Or smash his head in. Kenny, I'll, I'll, I'll think I'll do the same to you. This guy. Dad. It's just a boy. That's right, boy. Yeah. Chick yeah. Everyone chill out. Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Why not? Lily. And yeah, you shut up, shut up. Yes. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please He's not stop bitten, this. fool. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. It's Larry, right? Man, this is his son. Look around. I got a daughter in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head. Boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. I'm gonna kill him. Decapitate you. Just worry about Duck. Lee. Kill him. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. Then there'll be three. Then we do what you say. We toss him out and save the group. Lee? Quack. Man? What other choice is there? Finally, someone gets some sense. But we can't wait. We are tossing him out now. Let him. Let him stop. Knock this guy out. Happily. Quack. There we go, Kenny. Oh, crap. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my <laughs> No, you say fun. Every time, oh my gosh. Dog, get. Dog, get up and save your girl. 
Oh no, no. But in measure of the century. I, wait, why is it not going? Oh, thank you. You okay? Just great, thanks. Uh, guys? Yeah. Oh crap. Everybody down. Stay quiet. No, you don't say. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Yeah, seriously, dude. Oh. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of Quack. and Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was uh, uh, Dad! What's going on with him? What's wrong with him? It's his heart. My pills. Um, oh. Nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. Why would I do that? We'll get in there somehow. Thank you so fine, much. Fine. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Okay. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you, what's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good uh, eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, I some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Doug, what are you doing? Are we going now? The freaking dog's like moving all over the floor over here. I don't know what he's doing. Jax, where are you? Come here. Come here. Here you go, you guys can have my dog. Oh, buddy. Well, guys, that is where I'm going to end today. I hope you guys enjoyed part two of episode one. Um, we'll be back tomorrow with part three of episode one and might be the last part of episode one. I'm not sure. Um... But if you guys did like us, leave a thumbs up. If you're not part of Squid Family, subscribe. We're on the road to 300. We are currently at 270. Um, click the bell on that. Click the bell to get notified whenever I post a new video. Share this video with friends and family. Yes, guys, have a great day. Peace out.